corn season is about to happen, you've bought your little six inch transplants, you're ready to harden them off and get used to being outdoors. But you want to get them a lot of sun during the day, but you don't want to have to drag them in at night because at night the temperature drops and the wind chill blows through. If only we had a greenhouse. If only we could magically make one appear. Well, we can. I read an article in Popular Science, and one of the things they said was, get some PVC tubing. Now, don't buy it. As neighbor John tells us, the people provide. National Grid lays PVC pipe down to run gas lines. They have five foot high spools with five, 600 feet. When they get down to the last 10, 20 feet, that doesn't do anything for them. They can't do anything with that, but I can. So when you see a construction site, you see the gas company working, there's a dumpster, there's a trash pile. They'll take and throw away 10, 20 feet of pipe. Fine, that's us, that's for me. So the recommendations are measure the width of your bed, cut a piece of pipe twice the size of the bed. Now, if you have an open bed with no borders, popular science recommended, cut some PVC pipe into short widths and put it on either edge of your garden bed. That allows you to put your plastic pipe into the PVC and that will hold it in place. Now, we don't need no stinking pipes. We have raised bed with some 4x4. Four four. All I need to do is get to the edge and push this in a couple of inches down into the dirt. Stretch them out every foot, foot and a half. And then we're going to put some plastic. Get a cheap drop cloth from your local hardware store or home center. And I like to put a double. I fold it in half. I've tucked it behind here. I'm going to put two layers of plastic over it. Now the reason for that, the reason I'm going to do that, is you need to tuck in the sides. You need to make this, you can use a two by four, a couple of potted plants. I have a lot of bricks. So I'm bringing this down. I have an old handle from a rake. It's going to hold that in place. Tuck in the other side. This will let the sun in. Um, the issue though is this can get very hot during the day. So you want to take a steak knife and put a couple slashes. So during the day, this is out of the way. The heat comes out because remember, you don't want to bake your vegetables until the steak is ready to go on the grill. So during the day, they're getting sun, the ground is warming. At night, before I tuck myself in, I'll come back here and tuck in my kids. They will stay warm, that will help my seeds germinate, that'll keep my little sprouts alive. And then tomorrow morning, you'll know this is working because you'll see condensation. The warm air has come up from the ground, kept your little babies warm, and during the day, let the heat out. When you get done, when these beds are ready to be planted, fold up your plastic, pull your rods, bundle them up, put them in your stash spot so that you're ready for next season. So, instant greenhouse.